is something you don't see every day. Are you guys coming to the math club or are you going home? Okay, let's get started. This is a voluntary after-school math program at Sullivan Middle School in Bonzo. It was started by Principal Janet Wooden, and the students love it. She started a math club after school, and there are over 50 kids, and these, they, this is a rural area. It's tough to you know, get a ride after school, but there are over 50 kids that stay after school up to an hour and a half just to go to math club. Bonzel Superintendent Justin Cunningham says the math club was the direct result of a strategic plan called Integrated Learning Environment. The plan uses technology to focus on three areas of achievement. The first is self-assessment. We really want the students to become someone who self-assesses. And then the learner, you know, goes, okay, now, now this is what I need. Give me an application that addresses that. And we've got, we've got applications that then address that and are tied to the assessments. A second vital component is differentiated instruction. Computer applications provide a clear picture of a student's weaknesses. This allows teachers to set up a more focused, individual plan quickly. The third aspect is extended learning time provided by the cloud-based portal. It allows students access to web-based applications all day, every day. Within the portal, they can also add their own shortcuts. So all of my students have Google in the portal, they have Wikipedia in the portal, they have dictionary.com in the portal, thesaurus.com. So once they're in the portal, they don't need to really go anywhere else. The achievements using the integrated learning environment are startling. A district-wide 35-point growth in the Academic Performance Index. That was seven times the growth target. The ILE is also helping to close the achievement gap. A 48-point growth for English learners, a 47-point gain for disadvantaged students, and a 39-point growth for students with disabilities. State standards tests also posted significant gains, a 12-point in math, a 7-point in English language arts. The combined scores put the Bonsall Union School District at number one, the leader in overall student achievement in San Diego County. So what should I do here? Should I add these together here or multiply these first? The gains have been particularly exciting for teacher Kim Marino, who uses an application she developed in her AVID class. It's called Study Island. She took the Study Island application and really ran with that, with those AVID kids, and we wound up seeing a, a greater growth in our EL kids than we did with some of, some of the non-EL kids. And that brings us back to the math club. It's the integrated learning environment in action. Collaborative. It's like other people are getting different answers. We compare answers and see what we did wrong and then learn from our mistakes. It's differentiated. Some of us aren't doing really like that good in math, so we're trying to get extra help here. And um, I guess it's helping, so we can just come back. And it is extended learning through technology. Superintendent Cunningham says the integrated learning environment is truly a no-limits style of education with an exciting future. I had a board member um, one time at a board meeting say, so when is this going to stabilize and you're not going to keep adding new things and, and doing this? And I had to tell him, never. <laughs> We're always going to find, I mean, our whole thing is becoming better at what we do. So if we find a better application than the ones that we have now, we'll shift. Mm -hmm.